What's up, everybody? So this is Botany Manor, a highly anticipated game. So this is like a real life sim game where you are a botanist and you're learning about all of your plants and gardening and that's all I know about it. <laughs> and that's all I need to know to intrigue me to try this demo out. So this is the demo that was available during Steam Next Fest. And let's go ahead and try this thing out. Uh, bear with me because hopefully the audio is all right. All right, so I am playing this on the keyboard and the mouse. This looks pretty cool. Oh, it looks like it looks like a Beauty and the Beast stained glass window. That's what that looks like. We apparently like cacti. So we got a lot of cacti. Oh yeah. All right, so let's walk around. Um, E. Lady Arabella, we're so happy to have you back at Botany Manor. I hope you had a lovely trip. In your in your absence, I'm afraid some things in the manor have deteriorated. How long was I gone? Though I can assure you we tried our best to keep things in order. Hope it doesn't affect your research too much today. Bennett. Bennett, you had one job. Sirs. All right. We got a parcel. Enter to open parcel. Forgotten Flora, a herbarium by Arabella Green. That's my book. By Mayflower Publishing House. Dear Arabella Green, thank you once again for submitting your book proposal, Forgotten Flora. Please send this empty herbarium back to us once you have completed your research and we'll be in touch with a potential offer. Sincerely, Mayflower Publishing House. So we haven't published a book yet. We're trying to get it published. Well, that's nice. They sent us a book to fill in. So we got maps, uh, chapter one, chapter two, three, four, and five. Okay. So we have to explore. Oh, wow. So we got grounds, ground floor, first floor, second floor. Clues. Survivors of adversity. These are the plants that people kill on the regular. So they are the survivors. Chapter two clues. Peculiar petals. There's all your flowers, flowering plants. Botanical allies. Is that like green peppers and tomatoes? You want to plant them together. And then you have your climbers. Hello, Pothos. I know you're in there somewhere. Alrighty, cool. So, we are trying to publish a book, apparently. Look, we've already got one right there. That's, some, that's somebody else's book. Alright, let's go. Um, can I just have this in real life? This looks very much like the Cleveland Botanical Gardens. Okay, so these are different wildflowers. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. It tells you wildflowers and it tells you like the temperatures that you need to keep them at. That's kind of cool. Interesting. Oh, tab. Okay, clues. Important clues get added to the herbarium where you can assign them to plants. If you're stuck, tracking clues can help you organize and validate your research. So, windmill wart. 
Nanami Februa. I want to grow the windmill wort to filter the smoggy air in my conservatory, but I'll need to research its temperature requirements first. Okay. So windmill wort, can we go back? And is it on here? Uh, no. Windmill wort, volcanic flower. So it's a volcanic flower. So if you look at the volcanic flower categories, we've got different countries and where, where are we anyway? What country are we in? Because it could be 50 degrees, it could be 45 or 60. Tab. Text overlay. Oh, okay. If you want it easier to read, you can do text overlay. That's cool. So did we get a clue? We got a clue. How do I open my book? Nope. That's not how you do it. Alright, so the walking around is kind of wonky. Like, I, I, oh, that's right. Use your mouse. <laughs> it's not wonky at all. I apologize. That was me. I was wonky. It's a clue. The Somerset Gazette. It's 1890. I can barely see because of these. Crappy smog conditions. Horse bus drivers refuse to work in these conditions. I would too. What's this? Tis a postcard from Marianne. Mm -hmm. What does it say? Oh, rotate. Dear Arabella, on my hike I came across the windmill wart. Clue, a flower that only grows in Sicily. Some locals told me the flower has air purifying qualities, but due to its bespoke temperature requirements, the plant rarely blooms. Maybe the flower could help with the smog pollution in your conservatory. Marianne, you are a genius. So look, I live in England, apparently, but it will only grow in Sicily. Okay, that is a clue. Open the heat vent. Don't do that. Wait, what is the temperature in this joint? We don't know. We gotta find a... What's over here? Seeds. Potting instructions. This is very detailed. Oh my. Oh, look at that. Scoop the soil. Put it in there. That's cool. Seed inventory. Hmm. Hello. Do I have fish? Okay, we read that. So we need to go back to our clues here. So it's a volcanic flower. It grows in Sicily at like 60 degrees Celsius. Now we need to find out what it is in here, first of all. How do we find out what the temperature is? There's no thermometers. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to open the heat vent. Because we want it 60 in here. Does this say what it is? What is that? Oh, it says it right there. Oh, gosh. We're freezing to death. It's 20 degrees. I pushed E for that. Mm 
There we go. Now. Now we want to collect seeds. How do I add clues? Add a clue. Temperature charts. Postcard. Pop arms. Ta-da! Alright. Tab. I don't know if this is... Um, made for only keyboard and mouse or if they integrated controller into this but it's pretty easy actually with the keyboard and the mouse so place a pot on the saucer add soil to the pot plant a seed and water the seed easy enough right let's try it all right, there's a pot on the saucer, so we're going to add some soil. We're going to pick some seeds out. It just plopped itself right in there, and then we're going to water that little booger. And then it's magically going to... Oh, yeah. I wish they grew that fast in real life. Oh. Inspecting. I Rotate. It already has two little leaves. Um, where can we put it? Right back down where we picked it up. Okay, I don't want to inspect anymore. E. There we go. Cool. Now what? Explore, explore. Oh, is this it? That is, that's pretty cool. All right. I could see this being an enjoyable, relaxing game. So you have to look at, your, look for your clues to tell you how to grow the plants. Hmm. And then fill up your book. I feel like this demo has more stuff for me to do because these are just sitting here begging to be picked up. But it won't let me scoop any more soil. Let's just dump it in the <laughs> compost. <laughs> oh, it won't let me. Dump it. There you go. Done, so. Oh, okay. Scoopies. Plant. Water. Ta-da! Fun. Okay. All right. Well, that was a first look at Botany Manor. I can see this game being really fun. It looks very, um, it looks like it's going to be a big game. Like you have a lot of plants to go through. So if you're a planty person, this could be a lot of fun. The cr controls are very easy. Um, yeah, it's very, very easy. You use E a lot. But... Is this a new room? No, this is where I started. It's very cute, very relaxing. So, if you haven't tried out the demo yet, I suggest you go try it. It's only available for, like, maybe another day. I don't know when they're going to pull it down. So... It might only be available through today. So give it a try on Steam, um, Botany Manor. And thanks to the developers for giving us a, a look at the game that you've been developing. It looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. Thanks so much. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.